SIR code for Adobe ProLogic 2 version 3 includes an encoder and decoder in a single instantiation of the plugin. To achieve an end-to-end -end LTRT encode-decode workflow, you can simply instantiate an encode-only instance of SPLI on each of your source audio tracks, and a decode-only instance on a 5.1 AUX track for monitoring purposes. Start by heading into your Pro Tools I.O. setup. Create two 5.1 buses with stereo subpaths. One of these buses will be used for the LTRT print and the other for monitoring the decoded LTRT in real time. Import a six channel source audio track. Create a new stereo audio track for your LTRT print and a 5.1 AUX track to monitor the decoded LTRT in real time. Route the output of the source track to the 5.1 bus you plan to use for encoding. Route the input of the LTRT print track to the stereo subpath of your encoding bus. Route the output of this track to the stereo subpath of your decoding bus. Route the input of the 5.1 AUX track to the 5.1 decoding bus. And finally, route the output of the 5.1 AUX track to your control room outputs. Instantiate SIR code for Dolby ProLogic 2 on the source audio track, and make sure that ENCODE is the only option enabled. Next, instantiate SIR code for Dolby ProLogic 2 on the 5.1 AUX track, and make sure that DECODE is the only option enabled. Record ARM the LTRT print track and you're ready to go.